do we want? When do we want it? What do we want? When do we want it? Amazing. So like I said when I introduced myself, um, I'm a human rights campaigner at Get Up. Um, and I'm a very proud lesbian as well, and I lead the marriage equality campaign at Get Up. But I've, I've got to take my Get Up hat off for a minute and start with a confession to all of you, because actually a few years ago, I really couldn't care less about marriage equality. Um, as a radical queer feminist, there's literally no way you could pay me to walk down the aisle. Because if there's one thing worse than the patriarchy, it's the amalgamation of church and state. Am I right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I, I still don't want to get married. But um, after spending a bit of time with the issue and meeting a bunch of families and couples that it's really important to, I came to realise, well first I came to realise that it's not actually about me, um, but I also came to realise that marriage equality isn't even actually about marriage. Like, it's definitely about marriage. This isn't just a big elaborate practical joke, but but what I came to realise is that when the Australian government allows two people of any sex to marry each other, what it's actually doing is sending a message. It's sending a message to the elderly couple who've kept their relationship hidden out of shame for 20 years. And it sends a message to same-sex parents who are worried about how other people's homophobia is going to affect their children. And it sends a message to the young woman who smiles at her best friend's wedding and just pretends she doesn't hear that awful bit of the Marriage Act that specifically excludes her. And it sends a message to the young boy living in regional Australia who can't imagine a future where he's accepted for who he is. And that's why I'm passionate about marriage equality, because when our government allows us to marry each other, what they're actually saying is, you're the same, and you're accepted, and you're equal. <laughs> and I truly believe that that's another step towards true equality for all LGBTQIA Australians, particularly our trans and intersex neighbours, and that's why I'm passionate about this.